Uilah. Hey yo YouTube, what's good? It's your boy C back at it again with another lit video. Today we're gonna be talking about the biggest thing: how to pick up hot chicks. Yo, is that Sebastian? Yo, what's this kid doing? The gym, man. So, stay tuned. We're gonna get after it, and uh, I'll see y'all in a bit, alright? Hey, yo, see? What you doing out here, man? Why you littering, bro? Hey, hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Van Fowski? Yo, what are you doing here, man? What, man? Is this like another YouTube thing? Like you're just trying to be like everybody else, bro? Come on, man. Like, you know better, dude. I'm talking about picking up hot chicks, things like that. That's what everybody else is doing, man. The world don't need that, bro. Like, come on, dog. You know better. Come on, man. Like, actually talk about the things that, like, you're going through. The struggles you've been overcoming over the years and things like that, man. What's good, what's good with you? All right, all right, all right, all right. All right, man. Okay, okay. You don't got to say anymore. All right. You're right. If I'm going to start making videos, I got to be more like myself. Hey, but real quick, bro. Where'd you get them kicks, man? Oh, you mean the Chunky Donkeys, baby? Hey, that's in a future YouTube video, all right? Much love. Oh, I'm definitely... It definitely got some crusty action going on today. Anyways, yo, um, today's a special day uh, for for one, actually only uh, one incident. Okay, hold on. Uh, come, come with me. Come with me. Hold on. All right, here we go. Here we go. All right. So on the other side of that door is a package. Check this out. That sounded really weird. Okay, so I lied. There's two packages. Man, that sounded even more weird. This right here, the gold mine, okay? Check this out, all right? Bada bang, bada boom. Okay, looking kind of crispy. So right here, we got a package. Um, uh, for the record, prior to opening this, uh, this is not what the video is about, okay? Just, just let you guys know, okay? But. It's kind of crispy, okay? Hold up, here we go. All right, just gotta, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Dude, sometimes these things are just, come on, dude. dude. Check this out, boy. Check it out, <laughs> let's go. Here we go. Ah, what's that, baby? Oh, yeah, you already know. It, we're the, it's the Travis Scott, boy. Look at that. I'm going to tell you guys something, man. These are the perks of being able to live with your mom. Is you can afford to buy stupid shit like this, bro. I'll tell you what, man. Alright, so on to what this video is actually about. Okay, so uh, the last video I made, I was just uh, talking about like my depression or things like that. Uh, essentially, since September, um, I guess I could say I was like clinically uh, depressed. All right, um, and it wasn't until January where I actually started seeking help. Um, I'll explain that further in future videos. Uh, this one's just kind of like a brief overview of like what's been kind of going on and so 
yeah, kind of go back to what I was saying. So in January, started seeking help, seeked a psychiatrist and also a therapist and just been working with them to kind of fix some things, uh, some some mental things and uh, just kind of help reevaluate like what's kind of going on currently in my life. And uh, anyway, so uh, they prescribed me a medication at the time. It was Prozac. So hold on, check this out. I got all kinds of drugs here, man. To kind of explain the whole medication journey, because um, this is, I guess, kind of, oh, this is the fun stuff. This is the stuff that not many people talk about. Um, is So at first I started out with fluoxetine, which was Prozac. I was taking 20 milligrams. Uh, that actually did pretty well, uh, but I was being kind of greedy, and I was like, you know what? Um, maybe I'll try something else out, and uh, that, that wasn't the best decision, I'll be honest with you. So then I switched to actually a medication called... Uh, Desvenlefaxine, hopefully I'm saying that right. Anyways, uh, Prestique is the other name. Um, that was horrible. Okay, that, that um, I don't even want to talk about that. That was actually like, yeah, not a great decision. All right, um, because I, I, I thought maybe like, I didn't like some of the side effects on Prozac, so I thought switching it would help. That was not the case. That was not the case. So uh, as far as I'm aware, Prestique is a SNRI, Selective Neuroepinephrine uh, Reuptake Inhibitor. Uh, so it's a little bit different than the Serotonin Reuptake Inhibitor, uh, like uh, the Fluoxetine was, the Prozac. Now, um, that wasn't working. Okay, there was days where I would like literally wake up and like not even go to work because I, I had no energy. I, I, I was basically existing on that medication. Uh, the next one was a tricyclic antidepressant, which was nortriptyline, um, also known as Pamel or I don't know, whatever. Anyway, so I was taking the lowest dose of that. I, I think I believe so. Oh, two caps. So 50 milligrams. I uh, worked my way up to that. Um, that was making me fat. Literally. I was like, like I would eat and I literally felt my metabolism like turning into a sloth and I, I was drastically increasing weight. Uh, it helped a little bit, but honestly, it was just not, it's just, it was just not what I wanted. Um, so did that for a, a month, month and a half. It did help. But like I said, the, the side effects were just like, yo, uh, let's, uh, the Prozac was better. So then I sat down with the psychiatrist. I was like, yo dog, um, can you help me out here? Should we try something else? What's going on? What's good? You know, this and that. And so, uh, now I'm currently on sertraline. 100 milligrams, which is also known as Zoloft. And currently, this has probably been the best experience lately as far as uh, pros versus cons outweigh each other. You know what I mean? Like, as far as the pros are uh, outweighing the cons. Okay, so, so far I've been writing this out now. It's been about four to five weeks. And, uh, you know, some... It, and it's kind of hard, like, as you're improving uh, your symptoms, it's kind of hard to tell, like, what's what's doing what. Um, so it's like, it's like, oh, I'm getting better, but, uh, maybe I should try coming off. Cause that's what I did on the Prozac. I was like, dude, doc, I'm good. I'm good. Came off the Prozac, took a shit, dude. And it like horrible, horrible. Like it was just, no, don't want to talk about that. Uh, at least in this video. So, um, currently riding the Zoloft train out and, <laughs> and I was, yeah, so far, uh, nothing too, uh, too much to complain about. Uh, so anyways, that's currently what's kind of going on. And um, kind of what I just wanted to briefly explain, like, you know, this is the process of getting better is, uh, you know, taking drugs and uh, trying to do positive things in life in order to um, seek a better mental outcome because uh, mental health is important, just like your physical health. And uh, well, this, uh, this is what this channel is pretty much about, you know, kind of go back to body and mind fitness, ooh, you know, and uh, <laughs> basically body, mind, and they're kind of connected in some way, all right? Because if you feel mentally like shit, you perform like shit. If you eat like shit and you feel like shit mentally, you probably think like shit. So um, that's the thing. So this is, uh, so as the videos will go on, kind of just show you about how I'm managing to fix all these things. Because that's kind of what's going on. It's like, I just been in this process of healing both mentally, physically, because I have a lot of nagging issues from bodybuilding. I kind of previously uh, touched on this before. And uh, just this time I've been seeking more and more uh, guidance and help 
you know, as far as, you know, learning and getting my certifications and things like that goes into uh, the process that I'm heading into. So, like, fixing my body because, like, yeah, bodybuilding stuff, you know, torn quads, torn knees, torn torn eyebrows, you name it, it's, it's, it's happened. And, um, yeah, to kind of sum up and then just, you know, kind of fixing uh, the mental process because, you know, uh, that's also important. So anyways, I don't want to keep rambling, otherwise I'll probably talk forever. And uh, so, yeah, this might be the end of the video, may not be. And uh, until next time, uh, if I don't add anything more to this, much love, this is your boy C, aka, nah, Van Falski, he's that, he's that other guy, you know what I mean? But anyways, this is your boy C, uh, <laughs> just to finish off this video. Uh, I know it's been a little while, I, don't know, I haven't kept up to date, but this time I'm planning on to because I realized this the whole creative aspect of making videos and things like that, it, it did help me um, be in a better state of productivity and uh, get my mind uh, on positive things. Uh, so yeah, uh, if I don't end it off here. Anyways, much love, peace and chicken grease, your boys out like sauerkraut, and uh, until next time, alright? Oh, uh, wait. Is this the part where I say like and subscribe? Yo, Banff, what should I do? <laughs> it's in my fucking eyes, Jay. <laughs>